Well, there is always a special buzz on the opening day of any cup competition. The first and only time when all teams, regardless of stature, history, reputation, start from the same position. Everybody can have the same hopes, everybody the same dreams. This could be our year, we're going to do it again, it will be us at last. Those are the sorts of things we hear year on year. Hardly a surprise then that everybody is raring to go. And expectations are rising and decibel levels are rising. The noise is quite something. You could feel what football means to the people in this part of the world. Day one, and everybody eager to get off to a good start. Yeah, and it's obvious, Peter, you don't want to be playing catch-up after the opening group game. So we can expect this to be highly competitive. Three points here and the feel-good factor of eventual progression kicks in. It's a, a great foundation to tackle the rest of the, uh, the group games. So we're up and running. Jim, you've played in games of this nature. Who can make the dip? He ran himself into trouble there. Free kick given away. Move forward and quickly so. Kamada. Luis Alberto. Zaccagni. Oh, easy pickings there. Shifted upfield. Oh, no. No circumventing this opponent. Well, that was well positioned and, and well pinched. They can't hurt with their backs to go. And here's Immobile. Now it's Felipe Anderson. Well, he is the type of character who rises to this sort of challenge, and he will be back for more. Well, it's not the quickest of stars, but what it lacks in intensity certainly is made up by a, a large serving of, of discipline and organisation. Ah, he's given it away! Footballing width usually identifies with running room, and we've just seen a prime example. Referee's given a throw. Hit into the middle, and he's straight offside. It's looking pretty clear now, Peter, that the wide players have been told to, to get the balls in much earlier here. Yeah, Jim, I see what you're saying. Yeah, crosses that are not carefully selected, but they are very effective. 
He's had a fair tumble under that challenge. And it's Immobile. Stengs. And that has left him in a heap. And there's a beautiful simplicity about this contest. Willing running on one side, dogged defence on the other. That's good play. Luis Alberto. Ah, he's had it taken off him. He's a sharp little ball here. Good read, needed to be. Clears it out of harm's way. He's got the shot away! Oh, he did the hard part right, but fluffed the fit. And we hit half-time, but it has been a half largely of could outs and should-haves. Perhaps the more impatient amongst the supporters will feel their overdue a goal, but it's certainly not for the want of trying, so nothing to show as yet. At the break, it's nil-nil. To look back on the first 45 minutes. Well, this has proved a very frustrating day so far, especially for the strikers. Nothing has been created for them. I think the service has been extremely poor. Well, after 45 minutes, it is still goalless. A change, perhaps, after half-time. And we're already back underway here. Lazio, pretty fortunate not to be trailing at half-time. They've been lacklustre and, and second-best for me. And if ever a situation demanded a telling off from the boss, it's this one. He has to spark a reaction. Luis Alberto. Good spot, he's seen the run. And that's a superb pass. Immobile! So, time for changes on both sides, actually. Can he finish? Oh, nearly, but nearly is nothing. The mobile did give it a fair old crack, and he'll be encouraged to step up again. Defending strong and determined. And that could set him on his way. Zakani. Defenders on the back foot. Long ball by the goalkeeper. Now that's well seen too. And here's Pedro. Lovely bit of skill. Interesting ball. Pedro delivers. Oh, great header! He has done it! Spectacular header. He really flung himself at that. He had a choice of trying to volley that and get his head to it, and I'm pleased to say he took the right option. That's a great goal. Feyenoord are making a change now. Mm -hmm. 
Lazio get themselves into the lead. It's so often the case with goal scorers, little influence, and all of a sudden, bang. Kamada. And he's had it nicked away. For a moment, you felt that was going somewhere, but they'll have to go again. Chance! Oh, that was no routine save. Well, that was high-class goalkeeping there to back up his, his high-class wage. Patrick chooses to go cross-field. The two sides separated by the game's only breakthrough moment to this point. And the score is 1-0. Room for a shot. Oh, that's a fine challenge. They may end up with some regret with this tactic, but you have to admire their commitment to goals. Pedro has set up one goal so far. Almost there, and the players can feel it. A reprieve, albeit perhaps momentary. He expected better, and so did he. Lazzari. Now it's Pedro. Lazzari. It's loose, and there's a race for the ball. Nice physical challenge. Yeah, that does look a foul. Referee's given a free kick. Thank you. 